Hi, thank you for coming during the happy hour. Uh, I'm Prasad Valanki, CEO of One Convergence. Uh, we're a startup based in California, in Santa Clara, California. What we are what we are demoing and kind of talking about is our network virtualization and service delivery platform. Uh, this is a software solution which plugs into OpenStack and uh, it allows arbitrary networks to be created as a Neutron plugin. And on top of it, we also do what we call network services. And particularly where we're innovating is around network services uh, and the creation and the chaining thereof. So if I look at it, our solution is a, is a network and service controller. Uh, and we have a plugin into Neutron, right? And it works on existing edge switches, OVS. So we, we work on, we don't write our own kernel modules or any of that. We work on existing software, uh, including the OVS V switches or, uh, or overlay any of the, the, the demons which are existing in the Linux uh, area. Uh, what we work on is existing infrastructure, the, the top of the rack switches. So we don't make any assumptions of anything in the, in the networking. What we do is we, we kind of separate the problem into two areas. There is a network virtualization and what we call the service virtualization. In the network virtualization, we do our, the, the creation of overlay networks. And, uh, and that is basically using existing any of the overlay protocols such as VXLAN, NVGRE, or in future, any of these Ethernet over MPLS coming to full play, right? Where, however, and that allows us to create what we call the multi-tenant domains for networks. But where we are looking at going a lot more is in the service area. So while we allow arbitrary topology networks to be created, we also allow, we are trying to provide where a services can be inserted, arbitrary services can be inserted and chained. And in a fashion where we're kind of creating a, a overlay, service overlay network on the network overlay. So as services get chained, it becomes a lot more difficult to kind of chain, I mean, to basically create this service overlay to, to have network traffic to be engineered from one service to other service. In looking at the problem, we're also looking at how we kind of make it distributed. So in some cases where east-west, the north-south traffic can be arbitrarily taken into east-west traffic, we basically distribute that. And one of the areas where we are, in terms of we are trying to get the cloud technologies into it is the, where we can do elastic scale out. So depending on the, on the load or, or a CPU or the resource usage of a particular service, how do you scale out? And, and while in an inserted, and if you have multiple services inserted, the challenge, how do, you, how do you kind of engineer the traffic and also scale out, right? So we are innovating quite a bit on that, on that area, uh, while we're providing the, the, the whole overlay networks, right? Our solution completely goes into OpenStack. We are completely dependent on the OVS V switches and the existing whatever protocol. So we are not creating, as I said before, we are very, very much a standard-based uh, approach we're taking. So one of the things I want to showcase uh, over here is two, actually two, two showcases. One is inserting multiple services into, into a network, right? And then and while inserting, they'll be chained from a router to firewall. And the other part is the whole scaling nature of these services, right? So let me switch to a... So, I mean, I've been having a lot of problems with wireless here, so hopefully everything will work out pretty, pretty good. So what I'm showcasing here is our, our dashboard. Uh, the dashboard is basically it is, it is inserted into as a horizon right now, though it can, it can also support independent UI. So right now it, 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 it goes into horizon as a, as a tab, and it gives you the overview of the network. What I, what I, and, then, 
and then in the in what we show here is we can go to the tenants and what i'm going to show here is the creation of of this particular network which is yeah so here what i'm what i'm showing is a a firewall and a and a router being inserted into a network and and then and then it's it's inserted to a template we follow templates which are being as supported by the by the OpenStack, we use AWS as our format, AWS format, and then we create these templates where you can start the template, and then and the whole network will be inserted. The whole topology will be created, and on top of it, the the service will be inserted into the network. So I'm hoping that this will work based on our network here. So these are the various templates we kind of support. And we can extend it, and people can create their own custom templates. Here, what I'm showing is this firewall service, which, which I showed the, the topology being created. So again, I'm hoping that our network will cooperate and I'm, we are logging into our data center in California over VPN. So this is this is where we are having all, all day. I've been having problems. So okay, so there you go. So some of the firewall here, are the firewall services are getting created, and and the create is in progress. While that is in progress, I'll show something else over here. So the next part of the of the demo, what I'm trying to show is this whole elastic nature of our of our load balancer, um, where as service gets inserted based on some traffic generation, both in terms of the resource and traffic, we scale out the the services inserted sort of thing. So here already created this is the the template which which we pre-created. And here, what I'm inserting is a, is a Nginx web application firewall. And we are, our technology is independent of what services are giving, uh, get inserted. So we take a type of service and insert them, and then chain them and scale out. So here, I'm just taking a, a, a bare Nginx uh, uh, load balancer. It could be, and we're working with several partners where the existing appliances can be inserted into, into, into the networks. So this is just one of it. Over here, so if you look at it, this, is, this service is running. So this, this is basically the, the traffic pattern, I mean, where the instances agree. What, what, what happened is we've been running a, a traffic pattern in our, inside our data center, and as traffic increases or, or changes pattern, various instances get created, and then they scale up and scale down based on the traffic. And you can see here, these, these, this traffic pattern, you can see the auto scaling where there are, there are instances which are going up and down. You can see the, the, the number of instances are one, two, three, four. They go up. And the traffic on the port is, is demonstrated here. And this is the traffic pattern. You can see that varying of a traffic pattern, which is varying over time. And this traffic pattern can be reflected on the instance creation. Right? Um, and similarly, there is also this port. Similarly, the number of ports which are getting allocated in the network is also following the same pattern as the, as the, as the services. So, so, what, so where, what we're doing here is basically as, as we are monitoring the resource usage at the network, at the, at the, at the service level using, using the, the CPU and the memory, and with, with that we are calculating what needs to be done in terms of scaling and adding those services into the, into the thing. So overall, what we are providing is a, is, a, is a technology where you can insert arbitrary services, chain them together, and then you can scale them 
uh, based on the various parameters, which, which today we are looking at that network traffic, which also can be customized to something else later. Um, all this, of course, is available in terms of uh, in our booth. We can basically we can run through the whole demo at our booth. We are welcome to visit our booth and come by. Um, and the other thing we are trying to also we are, we are right now as a, we are in a semi-stealth mode and as a company, our product is not released yet. We are working with a bunch with a few prototypical customers where we are going to work with them to make it more robust and also uh, validate a lot of what we are doing. And in a few months, we'll be releasing the product. Uh, so, so that's where the status of our company and our product is. So that's all I had in terms of the demo and what we want to show today. Uh, we welcome to our, to our booth, and I just want to kind of, kind of showcase what we have and what we want to show. Thank you very much for coming by.